Welcome back to Iteris. This is week 201, day 7, the final day. And with 21 minutes left to go, I say we do this last battle first. See what bring us. <laughs> See what bring us. Ah, uh, you. I really did not like this unit. But you are the one that is not as terrible as the other one. Lysitia, Ninian, Ninian, so infantry pulse for Chrome to have instant dead eye because temples. Ah, da, da, da. You are too scary for Fion uh, for Bylef. Are you actually scared for Bylef? I mean, yeah, you. It is if you initiate combat. But we did tank a uh, legendary thing, name of person that I cannot recall. Legendary Cloud. We tanked the, we tanked the legendary Cloud. So I don't see why we wouldn't be able to tank Leaf. The question then becomes, where do we tank from? Here, I don't think we can get Lysitia. Well, no, actually, yeah, from here we can get Lysitia. One, two, skip, three. We can get Chrome. One, two, we can get you, and we can get you. So technically from here we can get everybody to come in and kill themselves on us. So we'll just do that. The glimmer of life. Uh, we still need to hide units. We need two hiding spaces. So you need to be here. You guys do your little thing that you guys usually do. One of you needs to go over here. And the other one somehow needs to end up over here. And you need to be over here. <laughs> How do I do that? I guess like this then. So I can swap over here and then I can put by left straight over here. I can move Uller all the way over here. Ah, uh, still leaves me with one space. I'm still short one space then. I guess this is a safe spot. Question mark. One, two, here, attack. Yeah, technically this is a safe spot because Chrome cannot reach that spot. So we can leave that spot for Ash, which would be the just in case unit. Um, all right. Show me the way. All right. So Lucina swaps with Bylef and goes right here. Uller goes all the way over here. Ready. Oh. Lucina swaps in. Good morning. And then Peony can still go down here. Special delivery. Maybe this way. Ready. Actually, is this spot safe? I think this spot is also safe. I think this spot is even more safe than this one. In any case, which it may happen, we don't need any ether, so... 
in case everything just kills itself right here. Alright, so we know he lives because of Miracle. But, just like I said when I was playing with Marv, the best way to deal with Miracle is just to kill you in one turn. Alright, Chrome doesn't reach. Actually, a lot of three things don't reach now because of Nod move. We're still in pretty safe position since the only one that is exposed is um, um, Ash. Alright, so that was that. We can now deal with everything else. Stay where you are. And we can get the ether if we want. Ninian or fallen Ninian? That is the question. I, I say that. we kill regular Ninian. I mean fallen Ninian first. Yeah, this match is pretty much already over. Next, we'll just put air to tank regular Ninian and... That's it. On this side. Good morning. Very well. Yep, I mean, come on. It's a Ninian that is built for nothing because she's infantry poles. Like, pretty much wasted stats. Yeah, like, HP. She's not designed to kill anything, so she's not gonna kill anything. What is it? Yes. And air takes the win. And um, that was a pretty simple final match. That's it. Um, the fact that people don't run hardy bearing anymore is just what makes this so easy nowadays. Uh with a made this week really easy using Bylef because she just kills everything. This puts us well into tier 39, ah, oh, just outside of top 1k, 1109. Yeah, I mean, we did lose full points of defense so. Alright, so for the, um, I believe it's only this one, because I did think, yeah, 18 hours ago, it hasn't been 18 hours, so we did see this one, so all we got is this one by Ethan. We got Peony, Fury Wings and Mercy Flower Guidance, Micaiah, Iceberg, Attack Resolo. Dagger with reposition and HP for defense too. Summer Edelgar, Heavy Blade Air Force. 
plus one cloud. I'm used to seeing a plus ten summer clause everywhere, but plus ten. I mean plus one. Drawback, lethality, sturdy impact, blade session, and finally Dorothea, swift impact, speed opening. So just go straight in after Robin. And yeah, no. A memory to cherish. We're in Dan Mikaya just. Although that means that she didn't actually get her brave effect. That means she doesn't have she didn't have the rest. Because I think that's how it is. Like she needs to be have enough rest to be able to double you through her better wave effect. Like here, yeah, I think here she did get her red effect. Or does she even have a red effect and I just run into one that was powered up by a uh, bridal Katria? I don't remember. Again, Summer. Um, now I forgot her name. <laughs> Summer Mikaya is not a unit that I see very often. Just dance him again and go after Sarah. And then I know he doesn't get this skill. But Fallen Star. Power of Fallen Star. He really put him to work with all those dances. Slowly grind. So, yeah, Lisa again. Weary fighter. Me, I mean, yeah, weary fighter means nothing. A memory to cherish. You doing which is an armor that doesn't have armor weaknesses, so that's why I think that's why they left her for last. And then finally Sotis takes the defense style. Do wanna see 56 speed right now? So plus the four sheets get 60 speed. Because I don't remember who kills her. I think it's Claude that kills her. He gets attack speed plus six. And oh yeah, it is that's what it is. Is total penalties on four greater than or equal to 12 unit attacks twice. Which of course it is. We got minus six to all stats. Then Mikaya plus fifteen res. So it is a break fake. All right, seven minutes left in the season. We'll take a look at how you guys did for this week so Matt takes first place followed by Oren looks like both of you uh, did well on the fire festival banner then we have Kenny Michael Promise Gav, Star Gluster, CLA, Brave Blitz, Lambrez, Neo Sourceman, Dogs, Yakiomi, Diego, Eva, Silver, Amethyst, mm, do we have anything to summon?
Uh, yeah, we do have the Dancing the Masquerade banner. So I guess for someone on this, um, red, I believe, which one is the four star? I think Lachesis is the four star, so I guess we'll go for Adlin. So red, colorless, blue. Not that I expect anything, but at least it's, no, it's good to know which one you're clicking on. And we get Erica. Oops, almost hit redeem. But yeah, next week is Regan and Otter are fine. Are the bonus units? We finally do have Otter, so now we don't have to worry about losing too many points on defense. I don't have it on any. I don't have it on any team at the moment, so definitely have to work on a team to get him in. Mm, not sure what kind of setup to use for him since haven't used him before, so we'll see. We'll come up with something. We'll come up with a team to put him on. As for offense, uh, we'll probably use Tiki. Might even try Chrome out. Um, since having Regan means that we can have multiple cavalries. It should, I don't know if it's still gonna be Earth season, but if it is, it should be Earth water then, because we last week was Earth wind. If not, it might be fire wind. Um, we'll see what the seasons are. Depending on who it is, is what legendaries we can bring over. But yeah, that is it for this week. Um, a good week, actually. I don't think we lost a ladder. No, we managed to get this week without losing a single ladder. So thank you for watching. I'll see you all next time. Bye.